Dr. Gertie Radnitz Corey was the first American woman to receive the Nobel Prize in Medicine. She and her husband, Dr. Carl Corey, shared the prize for their discovery of the cycle of carbohydrates in the human body. They had been classmates at the German University of Prague, where Gertie Corey was one of only a few women students. She received her MD in 1920. The couple married and began to work in clinics in Vienna. In 1922, concerned that war would break out in Europe for a second time, they immigrated to Buffalo, New York. Carl Corey accepted a position at the State Institute for the Study of Malignant Diseases. Gertie Corey joined him six months later after securing a job as an assistant pathologist. Although the couple was frequently discouraged from working together, they had a dynamic research partnership that proved immensely profitable in their work. Specializing in biochemistry, the husband and wife team began to study how glucose is metabolized in the human body. In 1929, they developed their theory of the cycle of carbohydrates, now known as the Cori cycle. The theory explains how carbohydrates supply energy to muscles during exercise and then are regenerated and stored until needed again by the muscles. It was the first time the cycle of carbohydrates in the human body had been fully explained and understood and proved especially useful for the treatment of diabetes. Despite their collaborative partnership in defining the cycle, Carl Corey initially received more professional recognition than Gertie Corey. He was encouraged to abandon the team approach and work alone. He was even offered a job only on the provision that he stop working with his wife. The Coreys continued in their successful collaboration, however, and in 1931 moved to St. Louis. Carl Corey took up the post of chair of the pharmacology department at Washington University School of Medicine. Over the next 16 years, Gertie Corey worked alongside him as a research assistant. Together, they made further discoveries that clarified the processes of carbohydrate metabolism that they had originally laid out in the description of the Corey cycle. In the mid-1940s, Carl and Gertie Corey received great recognition for their work. Carl Corey was appointed chair of the new biochemistry department in 1946, and Gertie Corey was appointed to a full professorship. The following year, they were awarded the Nobel Prize for the Cori Cycle. They were the first married couple ever to win the Nobel Prize in medicine.